Hey guys, so this morning I posted on Instagram and Facebook that my Eastern Hermans tortoise female was um, laying eggs, but I, unfortunately I had to go to work, so we're back here now um, to recover the eggs, maybe see if there's any more. But I better hurry because these, these tortoises are trying to eat me. <laughs> They're trying to get my feet. They keep going in my feet. <laughs> What's up guys? You think they might be hungry? I don't know. So I got some uh, handy dandy pencil for writing on the eggs to indicate when they hatched and who hatched, who they, you know, hatched from, or not hatched, laid. Treats to keep these guys distracted. Um, a tray that I'm gonna put some dirt on to put the eggs in. So let's go over here and give these guys something to keep them hopefully distracted long enough that I'll uh, So what I do to find out when I find a female um, laying, and it's not somebody that I automatically can identify just by looking, um, I go by patterning. It might have been, I don't know, it could have been her or it could have been her because they have very similar patterning um, that laid the eggs this morning. But I'll definitely double check and review the, uh, the photos and uh, in the video from this morning to see if that was her or not but and then for now I'm just gonna make notes on who did what I'm gonna keep this up while I do this hopefully these guys will leave me alone while I'm collecting these eggs okay so this is about the spot she laid right here um kind of see when I do that I don't know but it's it looks pretty much like she never even dug in there so that's what bothers me is that a lot of the time these guys will bury their eggs in and then they'll cover it up and I'll have no idea that they even what's up Mopani see I know her because she's got unique patterning and she's huge I got some of these girls that are real unique and I can, uh, I can tell some of them look very similar and some of them are newer so that they haven't, um, they're new additions. So I haven't quite named them or given them names yet, but they will definitely all get names. You guys need to go around me and get your treats. Come on. No, not my foot. Not my foot. Not edible. Sorry. Come on, Mopani, go eat. They're going to get all those carrots without you. Come on, girls. <laughs> I love Crocs. They're, they're, uh, they're safer than I think most Jews when they mess with that. Hi, lady. What are you doing? Hey, princess. You hungry? You want a snack? Hmm? You guys need to go get snacks. Come on. If I get going, um, and actually I think this is my newest female, so she definitely doesn't have a name. She's my, my new little girl. It took her a while to kind of like, um, get cool with everybody. Sometimes it just takes a minute. Go on, go on little bunny. I need you to hurry, baby. Please don't get in any fights, guys. Not that they really do. I, mean, I don't think I've ever really seen. I see the males charging at each other sometimes, but that's just because they want to breed the females. Ooh, yeah. See, once I poke in there, there's like a pocket of air almost. So it just kind of pooches in. Oh, I see one. I already see one. If you guys can. So, 
I know it sounds seems kind of rough like sometimes when we we're out here collecting eggs you look at it and you're like wow that how are they not like disturbing them or hurting them well I think it's just a feel like once you've done it once I think it's pretty easy after that to find the eggs um, when you've done it one time you just get familiar with what to look for and how to put your fingers in there plus you know it's good to have soil amendments um, such as like treating the the soil with like looser finer you know sand soils um, compost that's a lot looser and easier to work with um, that makes it a heck of a lot easier to recover these eggs so oh, that's a an interesting looking one it's more round stick that there so because these were just laid not that long ago I mean there's you have room for moving them a little bit more these are interesting eggs they're usually they're a little bit more elongated these are more rounded so I wonder if this is a first-time mama or somebody that laid a big clutch I don't know because normally I don't what are you doing This was not this was not yours and I don't have food for you so you need to go you need to go find some food or something okay this must be a new mama or something cuz that might be it that might be all we have for this I think it's just these three small little eggs that she laid hmm interesting but since we're out here what I want to do is I want to kind of dig around for a minute and see if I find anything else just around this area because um, sometimes these girls what they'll do I think I've said this in another video I'm um, sorry if I'm redundant but they uh, they like to lay next to each other like the nesting sites tend to be fairly close to one another. So just real quick, I just kind of want to feel around, see if I can. And again, not to be redundant, but when you're out here digging around, it also helps loosen the soil. So like when they do want to lay, they'll, they'll be more enticed to lay there because it's not as difficult to get into and dig. Yeah, I think that's it, man. Homies, bros. What's up? You're my nest digging partner? Huh? What do you think? What do you think? We need to come up with a good name for you. I know. What's up? You're super sweet, though. Yeah. What's up? What are you doing? I don't have any more treats on me. I'm sorry. These are usually where they dig in at night, so I don't think anybody's gonna nest over here. I always like to double check. Oh, hi! What's up, little cutie? What are you doing? That's another new female. She's super blonde. I think I want to call her, um, I don't know, Birch or I name all of my Herman's tortoises after trees. I'm not sure why. I just started doing it. No, they're all just named after trees and stuff. Sorry if my fingers keep going over the camera, guys. Kind of funky donkey to you ever doing this with the there was a nest over here already I'm just uh, that I've already collected eggs from but because it's such a nice fertile soil over here like just really easy to move like look at that ah it's like good perfect nesting material um I just wanted I just want to double check just because I think that other females will come over here and lay again like utilize this as another nest no, I think that's it. I think that's all we have for nests 
right now. Sorry, lady. Here. I don't know. I gotta go through tonight and document every single one of these upgrade because I got so many more adults now than even a year ago. I need to go through and take pictures today and what's up? Okay, hold on. And just kind of uh oops. Get <clears throat> oh I'm sorry. Get um an idea of who's who's who because you know the ones that have been here for you know two three years I definitely know them but some of these newer ones I have I don't know what's up mama what's up mama what are you guys doing look at look at olive you can spot olive from a mile away Olive's that one. She's got that super highlighter yellow head compared to the rest of them. But, I mean, as you can see, they all pretty much get along. I mean, you have the typical behavior where they get on top of their food so that the rest of them can't eat the food. They just want the food for themselves. Like, my food. I need to go through and till up some more and add some more soil to the back, back behind this board again. And um, this year they'll be getting a, they'll be expanding. I'll be expanding this enclosure. It's already pretty massive, but you know, who knows how many more adults are gonna get sent to me. Somebody's gonna be like, well, you've got lots of Hermans. Let's send more to you. And I'm totally okay with taking them, so I'm going to have to make a bigger enclosure for all these cutie pies. No, nope, not there. What's up? What's up? What's up, buddy? Another female. What'd you think? No, I might have to go get some more carrots. Let's see here. I'm gonna steal one. One carrot? No? You want carrots? Look at that turning its nose up at a carrot. What the heck? Olive. What are you doing? What's up, lady? tell you every time these guys are just such amazing amazing pets so easy to keep the way she's acting so when they stomp around they're not sitting there and they're getting kind of moody be needing to lay eggs. Yep. Oh, I got three little itty bitty eggs. I mean, I thought it would be a bigger clutch, honestly. She's a fairly decent sized female. And these guys are teeny tiny. Like, I don't have big hands. But that's. I have a small hand. Small lady hand. And they're so round. I call this my special clutch. Anyways. I hope you guys have a good day. And hopefully you found this uh, video useful. Somewhat entertaining, hopefully. No jokes today. I'm kind of tired. It's kind of hot. It's getting hot in her.
seriously could watch this all day. All right, guys. Well, I'll see you on the next one. Peace. Okay, that was dumb. Sorry.